Hi, my name is Steve Hayes. I'm from Winona, Minnesota. Uh, I have a consulting business called Day One Technology, and all I do is cabs. I cover the whole country, and right now we're in, it's February, and uh, we're in a Wisconsin barn. Uh, this is a maternity pen area, and a recently born calf in the last uh, 10 to 12 hours is, is next to me here, and uh, we're going to talk a little bit about calves. What types of diseases that you speak of is the calf prone to immediately after birth, and then how does that impact their future immune system? There's several diseases. Anybody that raises calves know that in the first two weeks of life, calves like to scour. They like to have diarrhea. Uh, actually, they don't like it, uh, but they have it. And uh, one of the, probably the most common one we talk about is E. coli. Uh, it comes from manure. There's manure from cows. It's, it's constantly present, but it goes much further than that. Uh, diseases such as Yoni's disease that won't show up at a cow for three to five, ten years, possibly can be exposed to a calf at the time of birth. So mycoplasma, rota, coronavirus, uh, crypto, all the different diseases that are present on a cow herd can be transferred to the calf on the day of birth. Why do you recommend uh, first defense over other scour preventatives to your clients? First Defense is a product uh, that comes from cows that have been hyperimmunized, uh, so it's a natural colostrum product, uh, yet provides protection to E. coli and coronavirus. A lot of the other products are just E. coli. The thing that I like about First Defense is that you give it to the calf right away. As soon as it's born, you can pop that blue pill. It's super easy. Um, and then you can give colostrum right away. You don't have to change any protocols. There's some products on the market today that uh, you have to give to a calf at birth, and the recommendation is to wait 30 minutes or longer before you give colostrum. It's so hard to tell a, a dairyman, uh, a calf person, to delay feeding a colostrum when that's what's the most important thing to give to the calf. So that's what First Defense offers is a chance to give it right away. It's simple and it's effective against both E. coli and coronavirus.